area. If you are just ready for spring, this is the easiest and simplest way to bring it into your home. And it's from Homeworks by Harry Slatkin. If you don't know Mr. Slatkin's work, he is a premier in the world of, of candles, a premier scent creator. He has earned the nickname, The Nose. He works with some of the finest perfumers on the planet to be able to bring you candles of such clarity, a word not usually used with candles, but these scents are so pure and so accurate that they just, they tickle your nose. They are absolutely joy. And we're offering you brand new candles, the ones in front of me, and you're getting a set of two. They're big candles. These are 18 ounce quad wick candles. These two happen to be a blend of strawberry and rhubarb. The ones to my left are blood orange and apricot. Already I can tell you that the blood orange and apricot is hugely successful. You know how far $20 goes on, on just store-bought candles. These aren't your usual store-bought candles. You're getting two of them for $39.98 brought to you by the best in the business. He's also a super nice guy. Harry Slatkin is joining us via Skype from his home because of social distancing. I would love to have him back in the studio soon. Harry, good morning to you. Happy Valentine's Day to you and your wife. Happy Happy Valentine's Day to you, and someday soon, maybe yeah. not too soon, we'll be back in the studio together, Dan. These are your new scents for spring. Uh, they are. They've never been shown before. I, I've got to tell you something. This is really interesting. I've got both candles lit, and they blend together beautifully. So I'm going to urge people, because people know exp right. how expensive Premier candles can be, to consider picking up both of them, because this is, this is just happiness in a flame. Well, you know, Dan, first of all, we have to remember, with all we're going through right now, scent is our keenest scent, and it's scientifically proven to change our mood. So what these two candles are, they're sunshine, they're happiness in a candle. Let's start off, for example, with the blood orange and apricot. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I was smelling these waiting to go on air. I'm in sunshine all the time, so it's not just a spring summer for me. I chase that happy sun glow. The light on me now is not, is not light I've added to the room. It's sun coming from outside. This one has blood orange, apricot, mandarin zest, and pink lady apple. So what I want to say about this one is it's sweet, it's happy, it's not sugary sweet. It just makes you feel like you've opened up a candle and sunshine and happiness are in your home. Both these candles are going to give you that happy moment. It's going to get rid of the winter blues if you happen to be stuck in that so stormy kind of world where it's icy cold. It's just an open your candle, happy moment. Your shoulders relax, goes right to our brain and starts to make us happy. Now, the other one you get, now remember, you're getting a choice of two. Yep. You get two candles. Each one burns for 50 hours. <clears throat> Excuse me. You're getting 100 hours total burn, strawberry rhubarb. Oh, my gosh. Now, this one is a little bit smoother than the other one. The other one is a burst of happy. This one is just saying, oh, my God, take me to the farm stand. Make, you know, put it up in your own house, the strawberry rhubarb jam or marmalade, wild strawberries, red rhubarb, apple blossom, and sweet nectar. And remember, I am only reading top notes. Every candle has about 15 to 20 mm -hmm. essential oils. And Dan, you know this all too well. When you burn my candles to the last little bit of wax, yep. a new note will always come out. It's never the obvious. My candles fill up your entire house but it's always sending a different sensation while it's burned. I, I burn one of Harry's candles in my office every night. Uh, one of my greatest passions outside of being here uh, is to write. And I sit in my studio I and I write and I burn a candle and it does change your mood. And Harry, I had never thought of scents per se as being seasonal, but you are the master at it. And this just reminds me of spring. They, they smell Thanks. like hope. <laughs> At you know, Dan, year, years ago, <clears throat> when we did Ralph Lauren's home fragrance, which we created, years ago, I remember Ralph saying, I don't, tell a, I don't do a product. I tell a story. Uh -huh. I make a movie out of it. And I've treated my candles the same way. You can go lots of places and you can get a candle. 
Mine is a movie. Mine's a story from the be beginning, the middle, the end. It's a wonderful, happy, almost like a Hallmark kind of happy story. And that's what every candle has inside it. So again, whether it's the blood orange and apricot, open birth, happiness, sun pouring in, sunshine, it's that blood orange, apricot, mandarin zest, and pink lady apple, or you go to the strawberry rhubarb, which is take me to the farm stand. Mm -hmm. When you put it up in your house too, it's smoother, it's really wonderful. And talk about a Valentine's happy moment with that free shipping and handling. Wild strawberry, red rhubarb, apple blossom, and sweet nectar. Harry, this is gonna sound like the craziest comment, the, one, down, the yeah. one thing that your candles never smell like are wax. Oh, forgot. No, 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 no. So, you know, first of all, we've been, I've been doing this for 30 years, and I've won awards. I've been recognized. The blend of wax consistency I have with the level of fragrance I have, it's a master um, science yeah. um, project in every product we do. It takes me nine months to produce every candle scent I do. So don't just think, oh, look at this, isn't that great? And you know what, he put the same wicks in this one and he just, and just you no, know, a lot of companies will do that. No, this candle, for example, starts off with me working with the perfumer, smelling the oil. That oil then comes to me, I like it, it then gets put up in a little tiny jar of wax. I like the way that smells, then it gets put up in a candle. Or if I like the way that smells, it then gets wicked optimized. If I like the way that smells, it then goes to burn optimization. If I like the way the burn optimization goes, it goes to pre-production. I then burn pre-production. If anything has changed uh -huh. from day one when I started, I kill the candle. I, it, there's no one does this like Mr. Slatkin. And yet he brings these candles to you at, at $20 a piece. I can tell you right now, if you want the blood orange, an apricot that is already limited. And, and we, don't, we don't necessarily say they're limited edition candles, but they just are by the fact of the matter of it takes so long to produce each one. Uh, I tell you, I really am enjoying the strawberry and the rhubarb uh, because it just reminds me of my childhood. And all, out of all of our senses, our sense of smell is the one that's most closely linked to memory. I think that's why candles have such a wonderful calming effect on us because they tend to remind us of, of better times. And Harry, the fact that you share this with us at these prices is amazing. Uh, Pat would also Thanks. like to say yeah. hello on Valentine's Day. Can I bring her in, Harry? Uh, can you bring her in? I'm, where is she? <laughs> there she is. Happy Valentine's Day, Harry. Happy Valentine's Day, Pat. Happy Valentine's Day to you. And I love that you both love my product and we have oh, worked yeah. together for so many years doing this. We absolutely love it. And what I'm going to remind everybody is with that free shipping and handling, Harry, and new scents for the season, stockpile them. I probably have my own corner of boxes <laughs> that I keep of the candles. I keep some for myself, but they're really awesome gifts. Thank you to that teacher. Uh, Thank you to the person who's been helping you shovel your snow. Yep. Um, birthday gifts. I mean, the that's mailman the mailman who's delivering all these yes. packages. Yes. <laughs> Exactly, and Harry, you and I know, and Dan too, because millennials love these candles and they know good quality yep. candles. So this really is an ageless gift. Uh, I agree. Pat, every time, every, time I, every time I go on air, I bring the candles and getting ready to air, but I'm missing so many. Because <laughs> my daughter and her boyfriend, always when they come mm -hmm. to visit, take them to college. Okay. So yep. it is a very big millennial moment. And then her friends come over, they raid my, my, my <laughs> cabinet of all my candles. But these, Pat, are really great because this is sort of happiness in a candle. So, you know, I've come on with my florals and my gourmands, and I've been doing that. They're wonderful. But when you open both of these, whether you're getting the blood orange and apricot or the strawberry rhubarb, and I have strawberry rhubarb burning right now in the house, and the entire house takes me to that summer farm stand moment. But I, chat, I follow the sun year round. I'm in Florida right now. Uh -huh. This is sunshine in candles. Yeah. So if you want to break from that winter cold moment, that's what this does. And, and it happens immediately. Harry, thank you for taking part of your Valentine's Day and sharing that with Pat well, and myself. Guys. Always a pleasure. Of we course. are very, very limited uh, on, on the blood orange and the apricot. It is last call for that. I will tell you, try that strawberry rhubarb. There's fewer than 1,800 of those remaining. Sir, have a wonderful Sunday afternoon.